Welcome back, guys. It's Adam from Emblem. And today I'm going to teach you how to crack a curated collection Emblem Vault and bring that asset back to its native chain. Pretty easy, so let's get into it. So here I am on the Emblem homepage, and I've already logged in with my MetaMask. You can see my wallet address in the top right-hand corner, and I'm going to click the My Vaults uh, tab along the top left-hand corner. And this is going to list all of my current Emblem Vaults for me. Now, I only have one, so it's pretty simple. But you may need to tab through. There are going to be some tabs here, unclaimed, claimed uh, vaults. So click those tabs if you need to, and then click on the NFT you want. And as I scroll down here, you're going to see a button, which is going to say claim or crack open the vault. So I'm going to click that button and MetaMask is going to pop up. This one cost me a little over $30. And we've had it for much less. This is actually one of the more expensive ones I've done. So just be aware of kind of the pricing on that. If it's much more than that, I would reject the transaction and try again. You guys, you can't really do anything wrong. If anything happens, you can always refresh the page, but this happened to work pretty quick. I just got to click get keys and sign that message. And this can, I've had this happen where this takes a couple of tries to actually get the keys. Don't be afraid to refresh the page, go to the My Vaults tab, uh, click on the claimed. Now the claim tab is live. Click on that NFT and scroll down click get keys again, you may need to sign the transaction again. It doesn't cost anything. So go ahead and sign it. And there's the keys. Okay. Copy that wallet address. Come in in my free wallet. I click the change address button, the options. I select the options and click import private key. And I paste it in there. Click okay. And then okay again. And basically this is giving me access to that brand new wallet. Click okay again, just select the correct wallet there. That's important. And then there's the asset. Uh, my test common NFT is now in my own counterparty wallet. Hope that helps, guys, and we'll see you on the next one.